Deus in auditorium meum intende. Domine, ad adivandum me festina. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Santo. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in secula seculorum. Amen. Alleluia. Lucis largitor splendide, cuius sereno lumine, post lapsa noctis tempora, dies refusus panditur. O splendid giver of the light, Though darkness covered earth before, Now that the gloomy night has passed, Thy brightness fills the sky once more. Tu verus mundi lucifer, Non isqui parvis sideris, Venture lucis nuncius, angusto fulget lumine. Thou art the world's true morning star, not that which dimly in the night is herald of the dawn to come and shines with only meager light. Sed toto sole clarior, lux ipse totus et dies, interna nostri pectoris, illuminans precordia. But brighter even than the sun, the clearest light and day thou art, Enlightening with blazing rays The inner depths of mind and heart E vincat mentis castitas Que caro cupit arrogant Sanctumque puri corporis De lubrum servet spiritus let chastity of mind prevail, and let not baser wants endure, but send the Holy Ghost to keep the temple of our bodies pure. Sit Christe Rex Pissime, Tipi Patrique Gloria, Cum Spiritu Paraclito, in sempiterna secula. Amen. Each morning, Lord, you fill us with your kindness. O Lord, you have been our refuge from one generation to the next. Before the mountains were born or the earth or the world brought forth. You are God without beginning or end. You turn men back to dust and say, go back, sons of men. To your eyes a thousand years are like yesterday, come and gone, no more than a watch in the night. You sweep men away like a dream like grass which springs up in the morning. In the morning it springs up and flowers, by evening it withers and fades. So we are destroyed in your anger, struck with terror in your fury. Our guilt lies open before you, our secrets in the light of your face. All our days pass away in your anger, our life is over like a sigh. Our span is seventy years, or eighty for those who are strong. And most of those are emptiness and pain, 
They pass swiftly and we are gone Who understands the power of your anger And fears the strength of your fury Make us know the shortness of our life That we may gain wisdom of heart Lord, relent, is your anger forever Show pity to your servant Give us joy to balance our affliction For the years when we knew misfortune Show forth your work to your servants Let your glory shine on their children Let the favor of the Lord be upon us Give success to the work of our hands Give success to the work of our hands Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Each morning, Lord, you fill us with your kindness. From the farthest bounds of earth, may God be praised. Sing to the Lord a new song, His praise from the end of the earth. Let the sea and what fills it resound, the coastlands and those who dwell in them. Let the steppe and its cities cry out, the villages where Kedar dwells. Let the inhabitants of Sila exult and shout from the top of the mountain. Let them give glory to the Lord and utter his praise in the coastlands. The Lord goes forth like a hero, like a warrior he stirs up his ardor. He shouts out his battle cry Against his enemies he shows his might I have looked away and kept silence I have said nothing, holding myself in But now I cry out as a woman in labor Gasping and panting I will lay waste mountains and hills all their herbage I will dry up I will turn the rivers into marshes And the marshes I will dry up I will lead the blind on their journey By paths unknown I will guide them I will turn darkness into light before them And make crooked ways straight Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. From the farthest bounds of earth, may God be praised. You who stand in his sanctuary, praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord, praise him, servants of the Lord, who stand in the house of the Lord, in the courts of the house of our God. Praise the Lord, for the Lord is good. Sing a psalm to his name, for he is loving For the Lord has chosen Jacob for himself And Israel for his own possession For I know the Lord is great That our Lord is high above all gods The Lord does whatever he wills In heaven, on earth, in the seas He summons clouds from the ends of the earth Makes lightning produce the rain From his treasuries he sends forth the wind 
The firstborn of the Egyptians he smote, of man and beast alike. Signs and wonders he worked in the midst of your land, O Egypt, against Pharaoh and all his servants. Nations in their greatness he struck, and kings in their splendor he slew. Sion, king of the Amorites, Og, the king of Bashan, and all the kingdoms of Canaan. He let Israel inherit their land. On his people, their land he bestowed. Gloria patri et filio et spiritui sancto. Sicuterat in principio et non get semper et in secula seculorum amen. You who stand in his sanctuary, praise the name of the Lord. A reading from the book of Judith. We should be grateful to the Lord our God for putting us to the test as he did our forefathers. Recall how he dealt with Abraham and how he tried Isaac and all that happened to Jacob in Syrian Mesopotamia while he was tending the flocks of Laban, his mother's brother. Not for vengeance did the Lord put them in the crucible to try their hearts, nor has he done so with us. It is by way of admonition that he chastises those who are close to him. Sing for joy, God's chosen ones. Give him the praise that is due. Sing for joy, God's chosen ones. Give him the praise that is due. Sing a new song to the Lord. Give him the praise that is due. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Sing for joy, God's chosen ones. Give him the praise that is due. Blessed be the Lord, for he has come to his people and set them free. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. Per viscera misericordiae dei nostri, in quibus visitabit nos oriens ex alto, illuminare his qui in tenebris et in umbra mortis sedent, ad dirigendos pedes nostros in viam pacis. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Blessed be the Lord, for he has come to his people and set them free. Because Christ hears and saves those who hope in him, let us pray. We praise you, Lord. We hope in you. We thank you because you are rich in mercy and for the abundant love with which you have loved us. We praise you, Lord, we hope in you.
With the Father you are always at work in the world. Make all things new through the power of your Holy Spirit. We praise you, Lord. We hope in you. Open our eyes and the eyes of our brothers to see your wonders this day. We praise you, Lord. We hope in you. You call us today to your service. Make us stewards of your many gifts. We praise you, Lord. We hope in you. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God, our Creator, you gave us the earth to cultivate and the sun to serve our needs. Help us to spend this day for your glory and our neighbor's good. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. Jesus, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of death. Amen.